All right, guys, welcome back to another Vex pushback video. Today, we're going to be talking about the GGC's response to the criticism from everyone about plastic 3D prints, all of that junk. So first, they start off with the custom plastic rule, and they talk about how they the, the rule has been kind of pushed to its limits recently, and especially this last season, where they talk about a skill gap being created um, because of how heavily plastic was used for innovative designs well i kind of see where they're coming from there's always gonna be a skill gap though for teams with more money and more um just resources they're just gonna be able to do better like i just don't feel like that's a good excuse because there's always going to be a team that has more money is just able to do more with plastic or is able to do more with any resource they're given in vex it was just plastic was just used um and that it was like that was the tool of the quote-unquote crime but the you're stopping the tool from being used they'll just figure something else out there will always be a skill gap i feel like that's not a good excuse and i think the gdc just needs to uh, rethink that but well i do say that i think this rule is needed plastic was used a lot and it push like for when the rules came up people were just breaking the rules and that is unfair in um you know because some teams have to follow the rules because there'll be different tournaments some will enforce this some won't it's like it's and it's just hard and it's easier for like the people who run tournaments that it just it was not taken out of hand i do think it was taken out of hand this year and it felt like it was going somewhere that wasn't vexed, which is kind of what they talk about. I don't agree with the skill gap thing they talk about, but I do agree this was going a little outside vex, and it was maybe going a bit too far. But this one is easier for the refs and the inspection people. It's easier for just everyone. It also gives you more, which I think people are just not looking at, it, is we get more plastic. And it is only 12. It only it is only 12 pieces. Um, now, everyone is saying being mad because of the only 12 is... And even though we get more, people just not talking about that. It's because we all broke it and we're just all admitting to that. But um, I think it's not going to be as bad as people think it will be. I think it'll be fine. And I don't think there's a need for it to change. But they do say eventually that they, they're willing to change things. Anyway, just moving on, they then talk about license plates and what's going on with that. Um, so license plates, originally people made these 3D printed license plates and all the sorts of stuff. And then, and then they also talk about 3D decorations. Kind of skipped over that one too. But no. basically, 3D prints, I get the decor decoration. I don't get the license plate. Because the license plate one was like, everyone had unique license plates. And it was cool. And it was cool for people to be able to actually add some art to their robot that didn't, like, wasn't basic. And there was nothing to do with skill. It didn't improve the performance of anything. So, yeah, why are we. You know, like, I don't think that it should be, a, like, a thing. I, I think what they should have done is said, well, if your lic license plates do just don't count as a functional. Because they talk about how there's confusion if it's functional element. Just say license plates aren't functional. They're just not. Okay? If it's touching the ladder, it's not, that's not, t if the license plate is the only thing that's touching, then it's not touching the ladder. And that was kind of something they brought up. I'm just like, this is an easy fix. You're taking away something that is a business for people. You're taking away something that is great for the community of Vex, something that brought people together, which is kind of supposed to be like the core of this company. And they're taking it away just for it to be easier to call. When it could be easy to call if you just say license plates aren't functional. That's a rule. Just make that the rule. I don't know. I don't really understand where they're going with that. Um, and so... I get the decorations, but with license plates and license plate holders, they should be allowed to be 3D printed. I really hope this changes because I made 3D printed license plates holders, and it was so easy to swap out my license plates. Now, I either make a metal jig or have to, like, um, get, like, just some kind of uh, just screw it in or something. I don't know. And you can't put two colors at once, so you can't use the IQ connectors. I don't know. It's bad, but that's about it for this video. It's just, uh, it's, I don't know if I like how 
Jesus is responding, but also nothing has been played out yet. So I think they're going to kind of see how the season goes. But anyway, yeah, that's about it. Um, yeah.